This is called an open letter to illegal aliens. It wasn't that them old Indians had such bad immigration laws, man. It's just that you European wetbacks came in such vast numbers that the Sioux and Comanche Border Patrol just couldn't keep up. And even after you've overrun them, taken their jobs, stolen everything you could steal, still, man, they'll let you stay. It ain't you, you see, illegal aliens, that these American continents don't want. It's that baggage that you slip through customs. Send that baggage back, man. You can stay. Send back your capitalism. Capitalism kills and steals. Ask virtually every imperialized human being in the whole suffering world about that and send back your communism. Communism kills and steals. Ask the Kyrgyz of Afghanistan. Ask the Mosquito Indians of Nicaragua. Send back all your green frog skin materialism. Money itself kills and steals. Your green dollars have worked the working class to death for generations and stolen from them the possibility of life lived like human beings. Ask the water, ask the air, what grief your green dollars have wrought. Ask the cut, bleeding, poisoned earth. Send back your Christianity. Christianity kills, Christianity steals. Ask any Indian who ever run on to a Spanish priest. Ask the uncounted dead of your own so-called holy wars and send back your Judaism. Judaism kills and steals. Ask the Palestinians, ask the Lebanese. Why'd you smuggle all that stuff in for anyway? I mean, man, things have been going along pretty well here for 30 or 40,000 years. Why didn't you all just try to learn American ways, learn American realities? If you liked your European-isms and entities so much, why didn't you just stay in Europe with them? You want to be an American? Man, be an American. Love it or leave it. Any gringo born in America is as Native American as Crazy Horse. Why don't you act like it?